What is up guys, How to Nation here and today I'm showing you guys how to install an LED fan. So today I'm showing you guys how to install this autolyzer fan that I got from eBay for five bucks. It's 120 millimeters, even though this case is only for a 80 or 92 millimeter one. But we are going to be installing it into the stock um, ASUS case essential that I got from Best Buy. And yeah, it's really simple. So you're going to see some screws if you take off the covers, wherever you're going to want to install it. You should see some uh, holes right there actually. And um, let's just take it out of the package real quick so we can show you guys. So this is a 120 millimeter LED. It's a blue one. You guys can see in the back right now. Uh, it's blue. It shows all the specifications and stuff, um, like the sound level, static pressure. It's actually a really good fan uh, for five bucks, actually, and it's not that bad. So it comes with these three pins, or well, two wires, and one's a four pin, one's a three pin. Uh, which go into different parts of the computer uh, you can choose either one either or depending on what your computer has actually so my computer actually has both of them but I'll be showing you guys just in case if you have either or of the wires so for the four pin one you should fo follow your power supply and there should be, be some wires basically just follow it down and there should be some wires that look exactly like it the four pin one and yeah mine brings two and then for the three pin one that one should be on your motherboard like it is on mine right there the three pin one and there is a difference one controls it depending on hot on how hot the case actually is and the other one just runs at 100 percent all the time so yeah so i got 120 millimeter one and i customly made these 120 millimeter holes i guess you could say and even though it's only supposed to get an 80 millimeter or 92 one but yeah so since I want air to come into the case, I put it this way, like I'm showing you guys right now, the frame towards the inside of the case, and just put it in like that. So you are going to need a screwdriver, obviously, and uh, the screws that come inside the package. And you're going to want to tighten them down, um, like I just did here, basically. So once you tighten everything down, all the screws and stuff, you should get the wire you get depending on which one you want to use i use the four pin one just because i want it to run at 100 percent all the time but if you want you could use the three pin one if you want it to adjust by how hot the case actually is but yeah so you're just going to want to connect it right there it's really simple really easy just connect it up and it should fit nice and snug so it doesn't come loose or anything and yeah So once it's all installed, um, it should look like this basically, just connect it up. It's really simple like I said, uh, and now we're going to turn it right on. And there you go, that's how it looks like. And it looks purple for me in the video, I don't know why, but it is a blue. And yeah, it fills up the PC pretty good, um, not all the way. But it does give it some light, especially in the front. It gives it like a lot of light in the front and like you can see it now, like in the dark and stuff. Yeah, and, and even in the light, you can still see it. It looks really nice. It's not that loud, even though it's running at 100% right now. It's actually not loud at all. Um, and it's really smooth. And it lets a lot of air in, especially since it's a 120 millimeter one. But yeah, that's how it looks. And I am going to prob probably going to be upgrading these to LEDs too. Or just upgrading a whole case. I don't know yet, but stay tuned for that actually So this is how it basically looks like from the outside with the cover back on it would look a lot better if you had a glass one That's why I'm probably gonna get a different case and just swap everything over But that's that's it basically and I hope you guys liked the video like comment subscribe for more awesome content from me How to nation and until next time how to nation out